Hello, everyone. Welcome to live interactive English. I'm Mike, and I'm Sam, and we are still making movie magic with only a smartphone. Yes. You don't need one of those fancy Panaflex Hollywood. Those things are like thousands and thousands of dollars. Yeah, I think they're like tens of thousands, or maybe of hundreds or of thousands of dollars. Yeah. A smartphone is not that expensive, but you can do so much with a smartphone. It could even turn you into a movie maker yourself. You don't need Hollywood's help. You have Apple's iPhone or a Samsung phone, and that's all you need. And if you don't believe me, I read an article, and actually I saw a video with some of their films. There were these nine Nigerian teenagers,、mm. and I don't even think—I don't know if they were actually film students or just high school students or just people who liked movies. They made science fiction movies. With their smartphones in their backyard in a small town in Nigeria. Wow. Yeah, and these movies look really cool. They have like a green screen. They have special effects. They have spaceships flying over the city. There are all these little short films they made. And in fact, they're so good that people like J.J. Abrams, the、uh, producer of the Star Wars and Star Trek movies. He was sharing their videos around、oh, wow. because he was so impressed with what these kids were doing at home with only their smartphone. And I think now a lot of them actually got jobs working in the movie business in Nigeria. Hey, that's pretty cool. So if you are interested in films or working in the film industry,、mm -hmm. you could start right now making making some movies on your phone,、exactly. and it could lead to a lot of who knows. Opportunities in the future. Absolutely. Wow,、if、that's you, really cool. With a little bit of creativity, you might even be able to skip film school and all the other traditional ways of getting into the movie business. Maybe your short film on YouTube that you made at home with your phone and your friends. That would be enough to get you to Hollywood. Who knows? Who knows? Let's check out today's article, and we'll find out more about movie magic on your smartphone. Now that you know how to plan your short film from beginning to end, here are some tips to help you make the most of your shoot. Change your phone settings. Imagine being in the middle of shooting a dramatic scene and suddenly getting a text message from your mom. How embarrassing! Avoid this by switching your phone to airplane mode. You should also check your video settings. Low quality videos won't look good, but high quality videos take up a lot of space. Hold your phone correctly. You're not taking selfies, so be sure to hold your phone in landscape mode. Keep it steady too. If you're worried that your hands might shake, use equipment like selfie sticks or tripods to get professional-looking shots. All right. So yes, making movie magic with only a smartphone, part two. So yesterday. We kind of talked about the preparation stages, and then all the different things that you might want to do in order to make your movie as successfully as possible. So let's see what we're going to learn today. The article tells us: Now that you know how to plan your short film from beginning to end, here are some tips to to help you make the most of your shoot. So now we are actually, I think they would call it in production. Yeah. The lights are there, the actors are there, the costumes are ready. You're all set. To go. So, what are some things you can do when you're actually shooting or filming your short film? Yes, and so we're going to look at a little bit about actually how to, you know, position your phone、okay. and things like that. Okay. Like the technical side. Yeah. Because、mm. we've kind of got all the layout and the planning. Right. And now let's see. So the、okay. article goes on to tell us, change your phone's settings. So imagine being in the middle of shooting a dramatic scene and suddenly getting a text message from your mom. Why? How embarrassing!、Uh, would I? I was, I was, I was crying over the death of my beloved dog, and your phone going line, line. was enough to bother me. <laughs> yeah, it really took me out of the dramatic moment、mm -hmm. I was trying to perform there. When we talk about dramatic, we talk about human emotion. This is a, a word we often use when talking about stories and how stories are told, or the feeling or the mood of a story. If someone says, "Oh, it was very dramatic." 
Then there was laughing, crying, screaming, wailing, jumping for joy, all sorts of strong human emotions. If you have a friend who's very dramatic, this might be the friend who might call you every day and say, "Oh, I think I'm gonna die. Why? My boss just looked at me funny today." So don't be so dramatic. Don't be so emotional about things. It can be a little bit tiring in a person in a normal day. But of course, when we go to a movie, if it's not dramatic, well, it might just be boring. Because in a movie, you want some drama. That's the noun form. And if it's the adjective dramatic, here's a good one. Al Pacino is known mostly as a dramatic actor. That's、mm. true. When we talk about films and plays and stories, we might break them down into two. Two main groups: dramatic and comedic, either full of emotion and kind of serious, or funny. Al Pacino is not really a funny guy yeah, in, in not, movies. Yeah, not not so much. Maybe in real life, though.、Mm. And also, I think I I kind of agree. I bet every friend group has at least one dramatic friend、oh, who's、yes. a little bit over the top.、Mm -hmm. And so then we also had this word embarrassing. So embarrassing is an adjective, and if something is embarrassing, it makes you feel uncomfortable, or you kind of are a little bit shy.、Uh, you you feel.、Um, Like you did something silly, and then、mm. you're worried that people might laugh at you, or、Your、you might feel uncomfortable.、Red. Yes, and I don't think everybody gets that, but I'm somebody who gets that, and my whole face can go red,、oh, and、really? my ears, and it's. It's not great,、oh. and, and then then you can feel it, and then you feel more embarrassed, and oh, it's a totally you know circle kind of thing. So it's four <laughs> it's four p.m. You had lunch three hours ago, and someone says, "Hey, you got some ketchup on your face." Oh boy! You've been walking around for three hours with like red stuff on you. Oh, it's so embarrassing. Super embarrassing. Oh my god! Or in this case of our example sentence, we、mm -hmm. have falling down in front of everyone was really embarrassing. Oh. I、They're think, all looking. Some of them are going.、Yeah. Like、I think that. that's like a lot of people's big fear of you're walking up to maybe get some kind of award、oh、or、gosh. in front of people and you trip and you fall. Uh, walking through the big dining room at school with your food in front of, it, and suddenly your food and you go flying through the air, and everyone's staring at you. Very embarrassing. And the feeling you would have, we would say you are embarrassed. Embarrassed with an ed on the end. All right. So yeah, avoid this. We read by switching your phone to airplane mode. You should also check your video settings. So go to the camera settings. Check the video settings. Why low quality videos? Won't look good, but high-quality videos take up a lot of space.、Ah, That's true.、Yes. You'll need space on your memory card, and I imagine if you're shooting high-quality videos. All day, your battery will run down.、Oh, yeah, so you'll also、sure. have to have it plugged in regularly. You don't want your phone to die, but you do want high-quality video so it looks good in the end. Yes, and it's also easier to edit and kind、oh, of、true. change formats and things like that.、Mm, That's all easier if、true. you're starting at a higher level of quality.、Okay. And then the next tip goes on to sell to tell <laughs> us. Hold your phone correctly.、Mm. This is something that I think is a really big thing that a lot of people might not pay attention to as much. But there are a lot of people who will film going up and down, which is not the way you're supposed to film.、No. So our article tells us you're not taking selfies. So be sure to hold your phone in landscape mode and keep it steady too.、Mm. Yeah, you don't want the phone shaking all the time. Like a shaking camera makes it hard for us to watch the film and kind of see what's going on. It might make some people kind of seasick. So keep that camera as steady as possible. When something is steady, it doesn't move. It's not shaking. It's not kind of waving around in the air. It sits there. It is very solid. Here's a good example. Keep the ladder steady while I climb up to the roof. You don't want that ladder shaking when you're up at the top of it. That's not good. Yes, and so there is a tip to keeping your phone steady.、Okay. It says if you're worried that your hands might shake,、mm -hmm. use equipment like selfie sticks or tripods to get professional-looking shots. That's a great idea. Yes, and so you might need equipment. Equipment is a noun. It is the word that just means the tools that you are going to be using for whatever you are working on.、Mm -hmm. So in this case. If you're filming a movie, your equipment might be a tripod, your phone, a microphone,、uh, costumes, lights, lights all、yep. that kind of stuff. That would be the equipment. And we have an example sentence here that says, "The workers are here to set up the sound equipment." Okay. So now we need to have the sound equipment set up. So that can be speakers and 
mostly speakers. Microphones, <laughs> Microphones wires, yeah. all the things you need to make the thing work. That's the equipment. All right, let's take a break, and then we'll be back with more wonderful practical tips about how to make your own movie. Hello, 大家好，我是 Tina。既然我们已经知道该如何从头到尾安排规划短片。今天的课程会提供一些诀窍，让你拍摄发挥出最大价值。补充一下 ，Sam 老师一开始说 “layout” 这个字 ，L A Y O U T 指的是名词，安排、布局或者是设计，也可以指的是版面设计哦。第一个诀窍呢是更改手机设定。想象一下，如果你正在拍摄一个戏剧性的场景，突然收到妈妈的简讯，这多尴尬、啊！课文建议。把手机切换成飞行模式，并且检查影片设定。低画质影片看起来不是很好，但高画质影片会占很多空间。单字 embarrassing 是一个形容词，令人尴尬的。dramatic 也是一个形容词，戏剧的、表演的、有戏剧性的。wail w a i l 是这里是一个动词，嚎啕大哭。comedic。C O M E D I C， 这里是一个形容词，喜剧的。第二个诀窍，正确握住手机。你不是在自拍，所以一定要以横向模式来拿手机，并且保持稳定。担心手会晃的话，你可以用自拍棒或者是三脚架之类的设备。Steady 在这里是形容词，稳定的、牢固的、不摇晃的。Equipment。在这里是一个名词，表示设备、装备，这里是不可以数的哦。这边有两个重点，接着我们进入文法时间。好，来看第一个重点是 now that， 它是表达既然、由于，用来引导原因的副词子句。好，这个 that 是可以省略的。那我们造个例句。Now that you've graduated, it's time to start looking for a job. 既然你已经毕业了，该开始找工作喽。那下一个重点是 make the most of something， 是表达让什么发挥最大价值，从中获得最大好处，或者是充分利用什么什么。像是 summer camps are a good way to make the most of your summer vacation. 夏令营是充分利用暑假的一种好方式。接华课文中。Use the available light and sound. Take advantage of natural light by setting your actors near windows. Close-up shots are a great time to catch clear audio, since your phone's microphone will be close to your actors' faces. Try using multiple phones. You'll probably want to film at least two angles of every shot, including close-ups. Capturing several shots at once saves time and makes editing easier. The best way to learn to create a film is to do it. So get out there and make some movie magic. All right. So now we're talking about some other practical tips. I really like the next one. We just talked about equipment, and we mentioned cameras and actors' costumes and lights for your movie. But if you follow the next tip, that last thing in the equipment list. Might not be so necessary. Use the available light and sound. So of course you can buy special、uh, movie lights, right? Very powerful lights, so you can film inside or at night. But if you make advantage of the natural light and sound, you're using the sun. That's what we're talking about. And the other good thing is. Natural light makes your movies look more European because、oh. they use more natural light in European cinema、oh, okay. rather than、I、American movies.、Uh, so that might be another good little thing to make your movie look fancier and to save you some money. Take advantage of natural light by sitting your actors near windows. Of course, you're doing this in the day. Sitting them by a window at night, not it, it's not going to help. <laughs> so in the daytime, of course. Close-up shots, it says, are a great time to catch clear audio since your phone's microphone will be close to your actors' faces. A good tip because、yes. if you're filming far away and a car drives by the room or whatever, you might hear that noise. But if the camera's up close, the microphone's up close, the audio will be much. Clearer and much better. Yes, and so the audio is a noun. This word is just the sound for whatever it is that you are talking about. So in this case, we are talking about making movies.
movies.、Mm -hmm. So the audio is all of the different sounds that you might hear, the people talking, the noises in the background, all that kind of stuff is considered the audio.、Mm -hmm. And so it's a very important thing to have clear audio because, at least for me, I feel as a consumer、uh, of videos,、what? I. Get really frustrated when I can't hear. Yeah, it really <laughs> takes you、talking. out of the story. It might even make you turn、yes. off the film because you're like, I can't hear what they're、yes. saying. Or if you need to rewind, and go, I miss that part. Yeah, what do you say? You、saying? don't want to miss something important. So、mm. audio is a very important piece to movies. And we have this example sentence: There was a problem with the microphone, so we need to re-record the audio. So the audio didn't come clear, come through clear because of whatever happened.、Mm. So they had to re-record it. Very frustrating. Yes, and so then our next. Tip, we have try using multiple phones.、Ooh. So this kind of sounds a little bit interesting, and so they go on to tell us you'll probably want to film at least two angles of every shot, including close-ups.、Ooh. Capturing several shots at once saves times and makes editing easier, which makes a lot of sense because then you don't have to try to make everything match up. Right. You have exactly the same video image. Just from two different screens,、That's、and、right. two different angles. And when you edit, you can use this shot and then use that shot and cut between them. It makes it more interesting,、mm -hmm. and it will make it look much more professional. So if you can get access to multiple or more than one phone, borrow a friend's and get your brother's phone or whatever. Do it that way. It'll be a great thing in the end. The best way we read to learn. The best way to learn to create. A film is to do it. Yes, this is something that you really will learn the most、um, just by getting out there, shooting it, making some mistakes, doing things right, following some advice, and working things out for your yourself. But really, just do it. So get out there and make some movie magic. Yes. And who knows? Maybe your film will be featured on YouTube. Maybe it'll even get you some attention from Hollywood, and could lead to all sorts of wonderful opportunities. Here's our what do you think question. Do you have a movie idea and describe it? If you don't, what kind of movies do you like? Hmm, I don't really have a movie idea,、okay. but I like movies that are scary. So I think if I made a little short film, I'd try to make a scary short film. That's a great idea. And a lot of movie makers start with scary films. They、yeah. can be cheap. You can film them at night. You don't need fancy sets and、yeah. special effects. Just a lot of fake blood. <laughs> You'll need a lot, a lot of, of fake、scares. blood. That's about <laughs> all you'll need, and new clothes, clean costumes for people. Thanks for joining us, everyone. Good luck making your movie dreams come true. We hope you get out there and try this. You never know; it could lead to all sorts of wonderful things. And thank you for being wonderful and spending your time with us. We'll see you sometime soon. Bye bye. 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 Audio，当不可数名词的时候，指的是声音音频讯号。最后一个诀窍是，可以使用多支手机拍摄。每个镜头至少可以拍摄两个角度，可以帮你节省时间，并且让剪辑更容易。看了这两天的课文，同学们不妨试着拍拍看，持续去拍，你才会学到更多的东西哦。好啦，以上是今天的讲解，同学们别走开，马上回来哦。Now that you know how to plan your short film from beginning to end, here are some tips to help you make the most of your shoot. Change your phone settings. Imagine being in the middle of shooting a dramatic scene and suddenly getting a text message from your mom. How embarrassing! Avoid this by switching your phone to airplane mode. You should also check your video settings. Low quality videos won't look good, but high quality videos take up a lot of space. Hold your phone correctly. You're not taking selfies, so be sure to hold your phone in landscape mode. Keep it steady too. If you're worried that your hands might shake, use equipment like selfie sticks or tripods to get professional-looking shots. Use the available light and sound. Take advantage of natural light by setting your actors near windows. Close-up shots are a great time to catch clear audio. Since your phone's microphone will be close to your actors' faces, try.
Try using multiple phones. You'll probably want to film at least two angles of every shot, including close-ups. Capturing several shots at once saves time and makes editing easier. The best way to learn to create a film is to do it. So get out there and make some movie magic. Hello, I'm Matt. And I'm Jamie. Today we're playing Guess the Bear. We each have three cards with words or phrases on them and example sentences where the word or phrase is replaced with the word bear. We'll each have one minute to see if we can guess all three words or phrases. Mm -hmm. So do you want to guess first? Sure. Okay, we got one minute on the clock. Okay. All right, let's go. First one is an adjective. We've all done bear things in front of other people. Her mom loves sharing bear baby photos of her. Embarrassing? That's right. Next one is a noun. The medical bear should be handled with care. He bought the latest sound bear for his studio. System? Some uh, uh, like things. Uh, sound, uh, say, say it. The medical bear should be handled with care. He bought the latest sound bear for his studio. Uh, let's skip it. <laughs> okay, next one is a two word phrase. Bear, bear, you're ready, we can begin. I feel a lot calmer, bear, bear, I've had time to practice. Once I have? It's two words, so bear, bear, you're ready, we can begin. Whenever you're, wait, no, oh, this one. I feel a lot calmer, bear, bear, I've had time to practice. Uh, if I, okay, let's go back to the other Okay, one. back to the other one. Um, the medical bear should be handled with care. He bought the latest sound bear for his, oh, out of time. System. It's equipment. Oh. So the medical <laughs> equipment should be handled with care. He bought the latest sound equipment for his studio. And the other one, the phrase is now that. So now that you're ready, we can begin. I feel a lot calmer now that I've had time to practice. Mm, okay, all right, once so you say it, it makes tough, sense. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. All right, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. All right, ready. let's okay. go. Okay, one word adjective. We noticed a bear change in his behavior and ignore her, she's just being bear. Dramatic? Yes, okay. one word noun. The bear is out of sync on the video, and the movie has horrible bear. I can't hear anything. Is it, oh, f music? Uh, Sound? Close. Uh, close. Uh, audio? Thing. Yes, audio, oh, good. Adjective, one word. Performing a surgery requires bear hands, and Tom held the chair bare for his dad as he changed the light bulb. Must be steady. Yes, it must be. All Yay. Right. All three. Wow. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, and I got so one out of three. Oh, so sad. <laughs> yeah, well, I think yours yours were harder. I don't know if I would have gotten that one as now that. The phrase now, now that. Yeah. The phrase now that because it could be many different things to start that sentence. See you next time. time.